Rich Gonzalez working for Caltrack here at 2019 Nike Cross Nationals. Been lucky enough to be at all 16 of these, and that was the most dramatic moment we've experienced, the finish of that girls' race right there. So much talent in that race, so loaded. Uh, what was it, 40, 41 state champions in that field. You knew it had to be pretty strong coming in. How did you feel during the race, and what was probably the most difficult part? Um, so I actually felt really bad during the race. <laughs> um, I just put a lot of stress and pressure on myself this whole week, so my body was just really burnt out, I think. And it was just really mentally challenging. Um, I got to 3K, and I was just thinking, like, I don't know if I'm going to win this. But um, I kind of just, like, shook my head, and I was like, no, you gotta, you got to keep going. And I made it to the last hill, barely made it up. I was, like, walking up, and then I looked back, and they were right there. So I knew, like, I made it this far. You can, you know, be in pain for another minute or so. So I just kicked in as hard as I could. When you got off that second last climb, the double terrace at the finish, you looked like you were definitely laboring and struggling up that portion, and then we were stunned when you looked so strong after that coming out. Did you surprise yourself? Did you think you had that much left? Um, I don't know. I was just giving it my all, and I knew if I gave it my all and still lost, then I wouldn't have been upset. So I just wanted to give it everything I had. You mentioned how it was a tough week for you in terms of all the pressure. Did you get much sleep last night? Did you feel pretty good, or was it pretty rough? Um, yeah, the last two nights I haven't been sleeping too well just because the time change and everything. Um, right. You know, I'm still in New York time, so it's a three-hour difference. So uh, <laughs> going to bed, uh, you know, at 9 o'clock here is like midnight at home. I've been right. waking up at like 5 a.m. Yeah, the first night I woke up at 4.30, and I couldn't fall back to sleep. And um, I tried to nap during the day, but right. yeah, I'm just, I was trying to do everything I could to get my body ready, but it's been difficult. So you mentioned the last few days how it was a bit difficult for you. Obviously, it was a loaded field as well. How sweet does this one feel given what you had to overcome? Um, it's pretty special. Um, I got to finish my high school cross country career with the three-time NXN champion. So my, my teammates here, me and my family's here, so we'll just celebrate together and uh, yeah, keep moving on. Outstanding. We've been very fortunate to see you not only perform as a champion, but also off the course, be a champion in so many ways. So congratulations, it's been everyone's pleasure to watch you compete here. Thank, Thank you. you.